Justifying climate change by reduction of... Throughout the world, debate is catching on about global warming and how the world needs to cut down on its addiction to oil. The signing of the Memorandum of Understanding to produce biodiesel in Kenya comes a week after the birthday of biodiesel inventor Rudolf Diesel on March 18th. Rudolf Diesel originally designed a diesel engine to run on peanut oil in the 19th century. Biodiesel is a domestic renewable fuel for diesel engines derived from natural oils. The Kenyan project will use a shrub known as Jatropa to produce oil. The oil has been produced on a small scale in some parts of the country and even used for domestic lighting. Already, 75,000 acres of land has been identified in the coast province to form a nuclear estate for the production of biodiesel. We are happy that the investor has identified the land and is ready to move to the next level. The production starts uh, in about October. The investors are targeting about a quarter million acres of outgrowers that will feed the industry in the next five to eight years. Whatever we are first going to point out, he will not just come here to make a big project here in Kenya. He wants to make a successful Detropa oil project here in Kenya. The big project or the, big, the, the making of the big of this project is going to be done by the Kenyans themselves. Just what is this Detropa carcass tree? A plant that produces seed that you can squeeze and process oil out of uh, the same. We have different sources of biodiesel. Uh, we have croton, we have palm, we have uh, so many other sources. But of all those sources of biodiesel, Jatropha gives you the highest yield per seed. Apart from producing power fuel, the perennial tree has other advantages. A simple plant that you can intercrop, it adds value to the soil. It's, uh, it, it cures uh, wounds, including uh, snake bites. Uh, you can produce uh, soap out of the residues of the same. A team from the Ministry of Energy is working on a biodiesel policy that will soon be introduced for public debate. The use of biodiesel as an alternative could check the escalating cost of fossil fuel and give relief to many motorists, apart from cutting down on dangerous emissions. And it would appear things are looking up for the use of biodiesel in the country. This is all that you can put in your vehicle. We are so happy as a foundation that institutions of oil uh, are now ready to purchase outright all the oil that shall be produced. Already, 6,500 farmers in Peketoni area of Coast Province are reaping the benefits of the tropa tree that is lighting their homes. Patrick Amimo, NTV.